All right, guys, we're back. Finally, we took a little break. It's the 2nd of December, and we kind of took a little break. I've been filming most of uh, November. I went down to um, Southern Missouri, and then before that, I went to Nebraska and had some awesome hunts uh, with some good buddies and uh, killed some really good deer, had an awesome trip. So um, then there, a couple times before Thanksgiving, Hunter was actually gone. Uh, I was filming my buddy Justin. We had an awesome encounter uh, out here actually where we're at tonight at the CRP farm. Um, he almost killed a pretty nice buck that came in. We had a doe kind of wind us. I think that was the November 11th maybe um, in between both those trips. But uh, yeah, we had a, had a doe come in and wind us and uh, he just kind of skirted and just stayed out in the CRP. But he was a solid buck and Justin was going to was gonna shoot him. Um, we came back uh, I think on the 22nd after I got back from the Missouri trip and uh actually hunted the same spot had a really good encounter with a deer that we call half rack he's got a messed up rack on one side and a five point side on the other he's a solid deer i think he's four or five um just didn't come in range that night too so um had a couple good encounters uh, we're actually going back down there tonight to the same spot we've had a couple really good shooters showing up here the past week or so um not really daylight yet but they're flirting with it uh, maybe a couple photos of daylight of those deer but there's one that's got a really big frame he's a, i think he's a nine pointer or a ten pointer just really awesome framing deer he's been in here and then there's a new uh deer that i don't know that we've got any pictures of he's got really good mass and just uh tall twos just a heck of a deer too so um i think we got four deer that we're going to get after here uh this afternoon hunter's got his iowa bow tag and we just got a doe tag for him. So I think the first deer that comes, that shows up, we're gonna let him rip. So uh, hopefully we can have a good night. We're gonna get down there. It's a little bit after uh, 2.30, so should be a good night. What do you think there, boss? Get it down, baby. It's <laughs> brown, it's down. <laughs> See if we can't get him his first Iowa deer. basically our thought with this uh, setup that we're going to. We got a decent north wind tonight. The deers tend to bed north, uh, west, and southwest of us. So it should be a decent spot. And um, we catch them coming out of all this bedding, uh, like I said, to the south and the west of us basically, uh, coming through this little pinch point and cutting across and going out to the uh, big cornfield here in this big bottom. So it should be a decent spot. It seems like that's what the, all the deer do. Um, as we work west to east and we got a north wind we're keeping them on the north side of us so should be a decent little spot uh, we got a little bit of uh, big and beastie in the little food pot that kind of was a little late getting in um, that we took advantage of but it just seems like a lot of the deer congregate right there there's a big creek that a lot of deer uh, hop it they, there's a couple trails behind the stand so we've got uh, I think three days until the opener of shotgun season here in Iowa and uh, last year um, at, at the same farm there was a decent amount of pressure actually on here um, and the neighboring farm so hopefully uh, fingers crossed we can get it done on one of these four bucks before shotgun season before uh, Orange Army kind of starts taking over Iowa so looking forward to it hopefully we can get Hunter's first deer. Well guys, due to our little construction job going on over there, our night wasn't too eventful. Only thing we saw was a couple does way off in the distance and other than that we haven't seen anything. So I think we're gonna wrap it up and call it a night, but 
me and Drake plan to be in the stand tomorrow. We're not sure where yet, but hopefully we can get something done within the next few days before shotgun season gets here.